Even small amounts during pregnancy matter. They reduce placental oxygenation, increase oxidative stress. Oxidative stress is like rust for the body. It clogs up and blocks hormonal chains the same way a dam blocks a river. That includes testosterone-driven development. Four, microplastics and softeners. They're in bottled water, food packaging, some cosmetics and cleaning products. You can't avoid them completely, but you can reduce exposure. And during that critical pregnancy window, every bit of reduction helps. What actually supports healthy testosterone action? Now let's flip the script. What kind of environment helps fetal testosterone do its job properly? Adequate protein and micronutrients. Not eat a cow a day, not endless protein shakes. Just enough high quality protein and vitamins, minerals, so the placenta functions efficiently. Hormone production and transport run smoothly. Healthy fats. Omega-3 fats support the function of fetal Leydig cells, the cells in the testes that produce testosterone. Good sources. Fatty fish, nuts, seeds, quality oils. Antioxidants from whole foods. Vegetables, herbs, and spices are loaded with antioxidants. These neutralize free radicals, help keep hormonal cascades clean instead of clogged by oxidative stress. It's not woo-woo, it's basic biochemistry. Stable blood sugar. Think less ultra-processed food, more whole grains, fiber, and balanced meals. A Mediterranean-style pattern. Lots of vegetables, fish, beans, olive oil, nuts is a good blueprint. Lower exposure to endocrine disruptors. Simple swaps. Glass or stainless steel over plastic when possible. Fresh food over heavily packaged convenience food. Avoid heating food in plastic containers. Again, it's not a magic trick. It's about reducing noise so the fetal testes can do what it's supposed to do. A surprising taste hack for later. Here's a cool side benefit most people don't know. Your child's future taste preferences are influenced by what the mother eats during pregnancy. Research shows that flavors from the maternal diet shape the baby's taste buds in the womb. 